Hi, welcome to our VB developing channel. Hope everyone is well, today we are here with a new video. In this video we will discuss about how to send email with attachment using VB.net. Let's get started. Alright, first of all we will add new form. And now we will write the form name here. Alright, now here we will add some tools, like text box, label, checkbox, and button etc. Now we will arrange all these tools. Let's we will add two more group box. Alright, now we will pause the video to complete the design, otherwise video will be too long. Now here you can see, our form design is completed. Let's see here, mail from, means mail will be sent from here. Mail to, means the mail will come here. And this is attachment section, if you want to add any attachment you can. Alright, now we will do the programming. First we will set the program for this checkbox. Now we will take a look at the names of all these tools. OK, now we'll set up the program for the Browse button.
OK, now we'll set up the program for the send button. OK, now as you can see here, our coding is done. So let's execute once. Let's look inside the password text box here, 
notice here the password will be the app password, that means this password is not the same as your email password. This is a 16 character password, which we have to create. So let's create the app password. Let's see here, first we go to myaccount.google.com And here we click on go to Google account And now we will select the account and enter the password Now here we click on security tab And here we scroll down and click on two-step verification. And here we scroll down again. And see here this is the app password tab. Now click here. Now see here, here we have already created an app password. So here we will not create a new app password. If you want to create a new password, just enter the name here, and click on create and the password will appear in front of you. And after that, you must be note your password. Now we go back to the program. Now here we enter the sender email. And password will be that 16 character app password. And here we enter the receiver email. OK, now we click on send. As you can see, the email has been sent successfully. Now we will check it in our mail inbox. As you can see here, the email has been arrived. And see the message. Now we will send mail once more with attachment. The email has been sent successfully. Now see here, comes the attachment file as well. So guys, our today's video was up to this. Thanks for watching the video. See you in the next video. Please subscribe the channel and don't forget to like the video. Thank you.